Hello, hello, let's and girls. This is Lord Kicker, and welcome back to another episode of Furacraft. And I'm getting my ass handed by this laggy zombie. Okay, I'll take you from underneath, you little bastard. Oh, at least I survived that. Uh, so, yeah, um, cost is actually on for once. <laughs> uh, been a long time since uh, he has been away on vacation, so... Uh, I think he's in quite a hurry to catch you up. Or at least he want to get some stuff done, from what I could gather. Um, he hasn't reacted to my awesome pillar yet, though. <laughs> I should really make a sign on it saying the awesome pillar. Yeah, so I have been going around a bit off camera here and uh, trying to light up this place. We shouldn't be sworn by mobs. Because uh, mobs are a pain. I guess I could put up some more light in here as well. Because I mean, I don't have it that lit in here. Let's see. What else was that I wanted to do? Oh, right, 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 right. Um, let's put this egg away. And I have a little bit of a surprise for you guys. And you will see it in just a minute. Oh, blown up a creeper. That is not a good one. Oh, it's turning day too. Sweet. Yeah, look at this. I saved up a few eggs, threw them down there, and managed to get two in one egg. Yep, twins. So now I should be able to get even more um, eggs out of this. I guess I could try and breed. Okay, you're not ready yet. Okay. Never mind then. I'll take it when you're ready. And uh, also, I have uh, kept the machine going up here. Or I did. I uh, did get a few pieces of iron and some stuff from that, but nothing too... Too cool. But uh, that wasn't what I was expecting, seeing it as it is digging straight down. Yeah, these guys doesn't do a thing. Good no. And I don't have to kick their butt. I wonder, did I leave anything good up here? Well, I left my bow and arrows. Other than that, not that much goodness. A bunch of dirt. Let's see, I guess I could put my machine over here. Let's put it right on top there. And uh, then we need an engine with some fuel and a chest and on. Here we go. Always good to have it pumping up a bit of resources. Uh, 
And I guess I could light up this place a little bit, at least. I wonder if Cost has even seen this yet. And uh, I also wonder if this is kind of how he was imagining it. I haven't done too much on it though. I basically just made a base of it. Because I'm not sure on the materials that we should use for it. But it looks like sandstone should be pretty good. I could put up a picture of... Uh, the, what shall I call it, the, the guild house? <laughs> the guild hall, that's the name of it. I could put up a picture on it on the screen here now, so uh, yeah, that is what it will look like. And I think that sandstone was the best base I could go with. Okay. Whoa, I was not prepared for that. Uh, yeah, uh, I did use a few of the uh, uh, birch saplings to create those fumes that I needed. So, and I also made a witchery chest for myself here now. So here is only witchery stuff. There we got with a magic, and we have breath of the goddess. Okay, so, let's look into witchery stuff. So, what was it that I wanted to make? I wanted to make a... Alright, um... Uh... Silver whack? Don't know what that is. Uh, oh yeah, I can make a altar, right? Uh, I guess it's better if I just search altar. Okay, click it and let's see. Exhale of the horn one, breath of the goddess, a water bottle, two of those. Okay. So, I have breath of the goddess, I need uh, exhale of the horn one, and I believe that that is oak saplings. Oh, fresh out of those, I guess. Uh, let's see if we can get ourselves some oak saplings. But yeah, I did cut down this thing. Forgot about that. And an X. So I can X you some questions. Uh, how many of those altar pieces did I get from... Okay, three, and I think I need six at least... ...to make an altar. So that means I need kind of a lot of these guys. So let's spread these saplings out. To get as much leafage as possible. Let's 
see there is a oak tree over here too. Gonna take it down. Okay, I thought I used vein miner, but uh, Okay, so cast had enough of me. Don't wanna see me anymore because of that uh, very nice pillar. <laughs> uh, nah, I don't know if we even saw it. So okay, well, we got a sapling. We got a few saplings here too. Sweet. Okay, let's put them out and about. There we go. It's spreading them out so I can get as much as possible from this. I do have a lot of birch right now. Hello guys. Any of you up for breeding yet? Oh yeah, good stuff. I mean, the more I can get in there, the more eggs I can get. And the more eggs I can get, the more of the... transformation stuff I can make. <laughs> And also, chicken is a good source of food. Because it's bloody delicious, that's why. <laughs> and I say that, and I eat steak. Well, I got... Got all of those spread out now at least, so it should be able to get some uh, saplings. But um, I'll guess I'll be back with you when I have those saplings. Okay, so now I got all the stuff that I need. Just one more water bottle in there, and uh, boom. Six pieces of altar. Pretty darn cool. Okay, so, uh, from what I have gathered, uh, I need to put this down on a place with a lot of uh, life force. <laughs> uh, or, well, a place with a lot of uh, vegetation. So I would guess that down here would be a pretty good place for it. Bam. Yeah, look pretty good. Okay, so now we have an altar. Can I even see it growing energy or... Yeah, cool. That is pretty darn cool. Okay, so we have an altar done. Uh, so... I think there is some stuff you can put on it to... make it faster. Does it work with zombie heads? I kinda wanna test that. Okay, so let's see, it is at 
1211. Nope. Zombie heads does nothing. Okay then. Um, what else do we have then? Where? Sure. I guess like uh, these kennels and stuff, right? Oh, uh, yeah. Uh, that is not gonna happen because that is too expensive. A during school. I haven't done any of these. Uh, Puppets yet. Let's see. Bone needles. I don't know if I have any bones laying around. I think I might have used them up. Yeah. I'm pretty sure I have. Nope. Had some there. Sweet. And there we have a piece of flint. I kind of want to make a doll. Okay, so. Spanish moss, string, and some wool. Do I have wool laying around? I do have string. I even had that on me. Uh, three pieces of wool. I think I need a... Alright. Yeah, so we need to go and shear a sheep, and I think we have one in the pen with the cows. Uh, I'm so forgetful. What was it more than that? Nope, it's just the Spanish moss and a little of that. Okay. And I mean, I'm not running low on Spanish moss or anything, so... Why not make a puppet? Boop. Okay, and that is number four. Okay. Let's see. So, a... Bone needle, I believe that was on this. And a piece of string. Some of this moss. And then four pieces of wool. And there we go. We got ourselves a puppet. So, seeing as I have been pretty unfortunate with my... I guess we should try and make a earthbound protection puppet. Also, I think I need to have a tag lock kit too, right? Okay, that's just a glass bottle and a needle. Bone needle. Well, I think I have some more glass laying around. And I don't know, do I have any clay around here too? I don't think I do. Ok, 
okay, I do have a shovel on me. And uh, no clay in there. Okay. So, let's just have a look if we can find any clay. Because it would be nice to have one of these. And, uh, I guess I could make the tag lock. Let's see, can we see any easy to get clay? I mean, I guess pretty much all the clay is gone by now, but... Wait. That's clay, right? Yep, it is. Let's grab a few. Ooh. <sighs> Got up. Okay. And we need a piece of dirt. Okay, I think we got everything. Some feathers. And we should be able to make this now. So, earthbound protection. Okay, so a puppet. One piece of clay. Feathers and dirt. Earth protection. Not bound. Okay. So let's see if we can bind then this one to ourselves. Uh, I believe you could take a sample from your bed. Indeed, and then you just craft these two together and oh yeah, bound to kicker or Lord kicker. Sweet. Okay, so with that done, I think I'm gonna end off this episode. Hope you enjoyed it, and I hope to see you all in the next one. Until then, bye bye.